वेलकम टू आवर चैनल गॉड्स ग्रेस टुडे बिलवेड चाइल्ड यू आर इमेंसली ब्लेस्ड टू फाइंड दिस लाइफ चेंजिंग वीडियो टुडे God is saying that you will receive all the strength you need at right time for sure. The problems you are presently facing are only momentary. For it is written there is surely an imminent hope for you and your courage will not be cut off. It might be probable that everyone is saying no to your future. But know that God makes the final decision. It might be possible that you are not seeing any sign of achieving that dream. But know that the astonishing blessings are already lined up for you. God wouldn't have given you this promise if he was not supposed to make it happen. Maybe you have waited for a long time for your prayers to be answered, for your blessings to come. But know that not one prayer of yours will go waste when you have hope. You don't turn over your bad circumstances. You don't worry because you don't see a way. You don't become discouraged because it hasn't happened yet. When you have a strong hope you only know that God is on the throne and he will surely take care of everything in your life. He is just ordering your steps according to the divine plan that he has made for your life. You may not have a reason to hope on anything in the natural. It may seem to you impossible but remember that we serve a supernatural god. So, don't just hope for a better future, have a very strong hope. Romans chapter 4 tells us, Abraham was absolutely convinced that God was able to do anything he promised. Abraham's wives was 80 years old when he needed a baby. The people were saying it's impossible to have a baby at this point of age. But Abraham hoped on in faith, against all the hopes he had a strong faith in God, and his strong faith did a miracle. Isaac born to both of them at nearly 90s of her age. Similarly, you may have not any sign of improvement in your situations. But if you have a strong hope like Abraham, you will also witness God's unbelievable works in your life. Look, God doesn't ask anything from us. but he only wants us to have strong hope in our times of troubles there might be some things that look impractical with your logic but that's the exact point where you need to have a strong hope in your life because at the times when you are facing a lot of opposition from life It could be possible that your breakthrough is near. It might even possible that God is testing your faith and hope in him. Because strong hope in God could lead you to those stunning places that you cannot even envisage. So, quit considering your situations and start considering your God. because he is the only one who can turn impossible to possible pray this powerful prayer along with me now to ask our father in heaven for not just providing us hope but a strong hope heavenly father i'm so blessed that you have given me the gift of life through almighty lord jesus christ 
I have witnessed your wonderful miracles and your incredible plan to lead me to my best. Today I'm just here asking you to give me strength in my weakness, give me faith in my fear, give me power when I'm feeling powerless. I'm keeping all my trust in you Father, the Holy Spirit at high place. When things don't go as my thoughts and plans, everything looks so messed up in life, at that times please help me. Help me to not just have hope in your plans, but a very strong confidence that you will never fail me. You have given me life and you will take care of it in your ways and your timing. Help me to identify that even if I'm feeling any pain, it has a purpose. My dear Father, help me to hear you that you are always within me. Help me hear that you are my hope over all the other voices. I'm running to you, fill me up with hope and give me a concrete reminder that I will keep strong hope in you. It will become so easy for me to pass the test to be closer to you. Embrace me with your love and wrap me up in your kindness. Refuge me in your care and protection and rescue me from the storm. Father, please assist me in maintaining a spirit of humility and praise during the trial. Father I come before you, bow in my heart and asking that you protect me from the evil. I ask that you protect my heart and my mind from every kind of sin. Dear Lord, shield me on the left and on the right. Wherever I go out, keep me away from trouble and let evil be far away from me. I affirm that I will not be a victim of evil causes. Accidents shall not be my portion in the name of Jesus, even though I walk through the valley of the shadow of death. I shall fear no evil because your blessings are with me. Shield me from the ravages of life. Lord, be my dwelling place. My kids are preserved by the power of the Almighty and it shall be well with us. I pray Jesus, please establish your agreement with my life that whenever I call on you, you will answer me immediately. Affirm this in the glorious name of Lord Jesus. Please like the video if you believe and spread this with everyone who needs God's grace. The next message contains something important that will help manifest abundance in your life. Please don't ignore it. God bless you.